Connie 2 Devios, all Classic Gamer here and welcome to another part of Let's Play Pac-Man and the Ghost Adventures. In this part, we're gonna check out the next level in Ruins, of course. So, we completed some levels, we got everything, and now we're playing Temple of Slime. By the way, this level uh, has to be unlocked by... I made it to the Temple of Slime! Good work, my boy. Okay, it's cutscene. another one of those ancient tablets inside. See if you can find it. Don't worry, Cersei. I'm on it. Ah, as you can see, it was the for one of the rare levels where the plot uh, made a progress a bit since uh, because there was a cutscene with a professor and stuff. Oh well, let's uh, play the level. So. For this level, you had to have a certain number of back dots, or else uh, you wouldn't be able to enter the level. There was the achievement for unlocking uh, this level, so uh, that can tell you how much it would... That, that, that's the proof that uh, you require to collect as much as possible of back dots. Then again, this is a Pac-Man game after all. If uh, if they were optional, it would just be freaking dumb. All right, we got rid of the stone guys here. There's a checkpoint, but before we get to the checkpoint, I'm gonna I'm gonna get rid of some ghosts and collect uh, back dots around uh, this circle, as you can see. Let's see. Come on. Well, he ran into me. He, they did not even try to defend themselves. They just run straight into me like, like they're stronger. Which uh, clearly isn't the case. Now, let's just see. Uh, let's uh, collect uh, the back dots and... You see? Running into me. Wow. Okay, here is uh, the line of back dots here. Let's now go slowly back. Press B to stop. Like, why is the why is stopping with a B button? I don't get it. Why couldn't they like uh, make? Uh, why couldn't they program when you like press just the analog uh, in different direction? He's moving forward. You press the analog backwards, and that stops him. That's how all the game uh, controls with the. Uh, Bowders, uh, granites, whatever you want to call them when you when you have those kind of controls. Anyways, here is a canyon and this is like... Uh, you can't deny it, this is like uh, from Mario 64, sorry, it's... Uh, it is it is inspired by that. You can call it a ripoff as well. I don't mind it, it, it sure is fun uh, firing the firing the characters from canyons, so I'm not complaining, I'm just uh, saying uh, which game did that first. Alright... BAM! I don't know why, but Pac-Man for some reason loses a power-up when he crashes uh, into that. I don't know, it's like uh, that hurts him, so he loses power, because when you get hit by the enemies, uh, if you're in a power form, you don't lose the hearts, you just lose the power first, then if you get hit again you lose the heart. Uh, anyways, uh, let's launch ourselves. This is a very fun part. I hope to see... I hope to see uh, designs like this of the level in the future worlds. Like, the ruins are really fun. The, fir the, s the third of the world better be good. They better not uh, be bad like the first world was. The first world was a freaking terrible. The generic futuristic city. I mean, nothing interesting. What? Oh, that's more like it. Uh, where do I launch now? Here, I guess. Bam! And we got a checkpoint. Alright, ouch! You're gonna pay for this, ghost. And let's uh, run around a circle, collect uh, back dots, grab the... That's more like it. Grab the power and... Uh, oh! Okay, that was close. God damn, stopping this thing is a pain. Why is it with B button? Why not uh, go with the analog in different direction? 
I played tons of games that uh, stop uh, uh, things like that on that way. Why? Why did they change? The and the controls, they cannot be changed. The def default controls uh, are here to stay. You, you, you can't uh, change them. Anyways, let's go here slowly. Oh my god, that al I almost fell down. Oh my, oh my god, that was close. What's up with the... Con ah, right. I guess uh, nothing... Uh, uh, that much interesting was here, but still, it's uh, just uh, collect. We collected a couple of pack dots. Let me now make sure not to fall down. Oh my God! Uh, all right, careful. Boom. Boom. Oh, that was close, but I did it. Oh my god. Okay, clearly something is here. Let's see. Oh my god. Oh my god, I, I can't stop this. Okay, I stopped this. What is this? Oh my god, what is this? Oh, the boss battle! Let's see! Ha ha ha! Let's see how do I kill him. Oh my god! We're running in circles, get a power! Oh yeah! Looks like... Oh! You're supposed to break his uh, teeth, I see. Well, then let's do that! Jump! Come on, come on, throw some more rocks! Let's see, I'm somehow supposed to... Ouch! Bad timing. Then again, I don't really care, I can just uh, get it again. Alright, here it is, let's aim. A bit on the right, that's more like it. The last life, let's see. Right after he stops raging. Jump! Alright. Jump! Come on, come on! He's gonna do it again. Boom! Let's see the last one. Oh, he's now gonna give me some. Oh my God! Oh my God! He's finished. Finished. Let's see. He's defeated. And the cherry. Let's let's get a cherry. Alright, alright. And end of the level. Finally. Alright, so this game has bosses, it's now confirmed, but why the first world didn't have the boss? I have no idea. The first world sucked. This one is so much better. Continue. Sure, right, sir. Good for you. Who cares about them anyways? I remember on some interview they like talked about them being the playable characters but I guess that's scrapped since uh... alright so we have to play the boss again and defeat him again off camera to get the different uh, collectible at the end and in the next part we're doing the last level of ruins called ruined maze sayonara